Hello, before we start, make sure to subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell to receive updates when we upload new videos. Versatile, spacious and sporty. The exterior design is characterized by sporty features. A distinctive off-road look is accentuated by muscular surface contours and striking details such as the chrome trim that now continues from the front end to the rear as standard, the redesigned headlamps and the heavily contoured radiator grille. The GLC Coupe marks itself out with its dynamic appearance and elegant lines. This model shows how harmoniously the design features of a coupé can be reconciled with those of an SUV, with a descending roof line, a greenhouse that blends perfectly into the silhouette, the character line in combination with the distinctive chrome strip on the high belt line, and the muscular shoulders. Both models are now equipped with LED high-performance headlamps as standard. Their contours have been significantly changed, and they are now smaller and flatter. This makes the torch-like outline of the daytime driving lights even more prominent, and the typical Mercedes-Benz light signature even more recognizable. MULTIBEAM LED headlamps are available as optional equipment. Redesigned all LED rear lights are also included as standard. As an alternative to the standard agility control suspension, the steel dynamic body control suspension with adjustable damping is available. The damping is individually controlled at each wheel depending on the driving situation, speed and the condition of the road surface. Different suspension characteristics can be chosen using the dynamic select switch. In the two setups, Sport and Sport Plus, the damping is more taut, while ride comfort is maximized in Comfort mode and Eco mode makes for particularly economical driving. Depending on the suspension, and in combination with the optional off-road engineering package, two off-road driving modes are also available. The off-road mode is highly suitable for loose surfaces such as sand or gravel and snow. Off-road plus is available for terrain with a firm or rocky surface or steep gradients. In this mode, traction control by means of specific wheel selective braking intervention simulates the effect of an active locking differential. The driving modes also modify the engine, transmission and steering characteristics. The air body control air suspension can be chosen for even more comfort and variability. In combination with the standard dynamic select, this also makes it possible to lower or raise the vehicle level by 15 mm, and by as much as 100 mm with the optional off-road engineering package. The new engine generation is of great importance for reducing CO2 emissions, and is a systematic advancement with regard to lowering consumption. New technological features of the petrol engines are above all the variable Camtronic valve timing, which heats up the exhaust system more rapidly, the twin-scroll turbocharger and the 48-volt system with a belt-driven starter alternator EQ boost. This increases agility, improves ride comfort and considerably lowers fuel consumption, as the system makes important hybrid functions such as recuperation, boosting, and gliding possible.
New front and rear bumpers and a new radiator grille reinforce the SUV look, LED high-performance headlamps are now standard equipment, and flatter than before, while redesigned all LED rear lights are also standard. New features in the interior include high-quality displays in the m -Bux style, among them the fully digital instrument cluster optional, and the media display with touch control, a new multifunction steering wheel and new colors and trim. The model series has the new generation of Mercedes-Benz petrol and diesel engines. The 48-volt system with EQ Boost allows additional functions for the petrol engines which help to reduce fuel consumption while improving agility and comfort. All the diesel variants already meet the Euro 6 standard which only becomes mandatory for new models from 1 January 2020, and a year later for all vehicles. The GLC and GLC Coupe can drive in semi-automated mode in certain situations. Functions familiar from the S-Class are available in the driving assistance package. As an alternative to the agility control suspension included as standard, and for the first time in the GLC SUV, the dynamic body control steel suspension with adjustable damping is available. The air body control air suspension can be chosen for even more comfort and variability. As standard, the GLC and GLC Coupe are equipped with m bucks Mercedes-Benz user experience including the extended functions with Hey Mercedes, and optionally the m bucks interior assistant. This makes control easier, as it is able to recognize and distinguish between arm and hand gestures by the driver and front passenger. The optional energizing comfort control networks different onboard comfort systems, and uses lighting and music moods for a variety of feel-good programs. The energizing coach recommends programs according to the situation. Multi-contour seats are available for the GLC and GLC Coupe for the first time. In the interior, a high quality of finish and high-grade materials such as open-poured wood are combined with user-friendly controls. As standard, GLC features the modern, learn-capable infotainment system. Its strengths include intuitive control using a variety of inputs such as touch control, gesture control and the optimized voice control system hey Mercedes, as standard. The augmented reality function for navigation adds useful navigation information to a video image of the surroundings. The optional energizing comfort control networks different onboard comfort systems, and ensures a relaxed arrival after a long journey. The energizing coach is based on an intelligent algorithm, and recommends one of the programs in the energizing packages suited to the individual and situation. The driving assistance systems have been considerably extended. Active Distance Assist Distronic and Active Steer Assist provide even more comfortable support to help the driver to keep a safe distance and steer. The speed is adjusted automatically ahead of bends or junctions. Active steer assist helps with forming an emergency corridor and with changing lanes. The risk of potential collisions can be reduced by the turn-off function of active brake assist, by automatic braking if the driver fails to see oncoming traffic. Also new is trailer maneuvering assist, which provides assistance when maneuvering in reverse.
Thank you for watching and don't forget to like, subscribe and share this video. Subscribe to Auto TV.